In this video, we're going to take a look at the Universal Collective, thus global energy for the Taurus full moon, November 2024. The energy we are working with and how we can make it the best life moving forward. My name is Edward, psychic medium, animal communicator, your soul messenger host, assisting us all, including myself, to live, love, and manifest the life that a soul intended for us to live this lifetime. Let's get busy. All right. So, quick introduction. Go to my website, edwardregasta.community. Link readings. There you can see my current rates, availability, where you can make an appointment. You can see me in person, either Sugarloaf or Warwick, New York, though mostly Warwick, New York, through Light Club Curiosity Shop. You can do a telephone reading with me. You can also do an online reading via Zoom. All right. For all the videos that are current and are free to view, go to my website, link Medium Tarot TV. Everything will be there that is current when you visit. Accompanying theme, healing songs, and where you can subscribe for more daily videos, daily insight, foresight, be just soul, Medium Tarot TV Plus. All right, enough of that. Now let's get to the... Um, Let's get to the uh, the forecast. All right, so we are continuing where we left off with the Zodiac year 2024, which runs through spring of 2025, I think through the end of like March 28th, 2025. You watch that video and the current, whenever you're viewing, but the current solar month energy as of filming is Scorpio 2024. Those are both on the website link Medium Tarot TV. So we're going to pick up where we left off with that. Going to the current week energy, which is going to be the strongest. I did not do that. So I'm going to have to make a note to put that in the description below when it's going to be the strongest. So we are working with the energy of, well, it comes right down to it, increase of finances. Bing, bang, boom. Uh, what can I say? This is, this is a money-themed full moon. It usually is with Taurus being a very productive sign. Now, this energy that we have for the week energy is the planet Earth. Mercury in Taurus. So Mercury is, among other things, our mindset. So this is how we view our perspective, what we think about money. And there's always two sides of a story, of a tale, two sides to a coin to go with the reference. And here we have to be careful of poverty consciousness. Been there, done that. That is coming from lack or loss. We've all experienced financial hardship at one point or another. Most of us have. And that feeling that of loss or lack. But we're not to get stuck in that mindset because what we think is possible is possible. What we think we can create Attract, manifest is what we actually can, for the most part, within reason. Attract, create, manifest. So it's always a check-in with the Taurus full moon of this. Our consciousness towards money. Our relationship towards money. Or with money. Good old money. Now, money isn't everything, but it certainly helps when we're on planet Earth. So, all right. But this, in essence, is increase of finances. So that's going to be on a lot of people's minds at this time. If not throughout the, uh, the year, right? Just keep in mind that assistance is always available. Okay? Somehow. Might not be to the degree that you think it should be, but it always is. So if need be, please reach out for assistance. All 
All right, I'm good with that. We're going to move on to the day energy. Now, everything discussed here is an influence for the entire lunar month, November 15th through December 14th, 2024. Now, the day energy. So, obviously, we have the moon in Taurus. The planet Saturn goes direct, 9.20 a.m. Eastern. That is significant because when we get to the Psychic Insight theme, which is the next energy, has to do with the planet Saturn. So, generally speaking, when a planet is retrograde, it's almost like held back. It's a pause. When the planet goes direct, even though it takes time for it to gain momentum and move forward again, there's more a time, energy, direction, push, launch. So in, in Saturn and Taurus fashion, it's a slow burn. But momentum all the same, which is good when we get to the next energy. Though, back to the day energy. The actual full moon is at 428 p.m. Eastern. And please adjust the time to where you are on the globe. Color of the day is purple. Beautiful. Love the color purple. All right, so we are continuing with what is known as the soul's journey three-week crash course of the soul where we are brought our attention to a major life lesson. Some we have learned, some we're still in the midst of learning, some we need to learn. And if we get one out of those three weeks, we're so ahead of the game. We're in this cycle four times a year, right? So if we get four major life lessons each calendar year, that's a big deal. Wonderful towards soul growth and evolution. Now, this is the energy, the astrological attribution association is the, is the influence of the planet Jupiter. Jupiter represents, among other things, luck, expansion, growth, soul growth, soul evolution. That's the name of the game. But this is activity, okay? This is good. This is movement. This is good. This is fate. Now, keeping in mind, we create our own luck, okay? So, feeling lucky? I hope so. But this is an energy where it's hard to pin down. It's moving. It's, it's in movement, so things are in the works. Keep that in mind. Throughout this lunar month, things are in the works. We'll see some signs, even if it's not as much advancement as we would like, but we are, according to the system that I utilize, we are in the, well, also according to the, the calendar, we are in the autumn season. And I feel the autumn season whether it's the Universal Collective or our personal year, is the most productive. And this is a very productive full moon. Of course, how could it not be? Taurus is a very productive energy sign. So, do not be concerned about anything. Just make sure that you are in your personal flow to make things happen. Either with increase of finances, or we're going to expand upon that with the next energy. All right. And then we're going to move to the Psychic Insight theme for this full moon. The Taurus full moon is at 24 degrees. If you're astrologically inclined, you look to see where 24 degrees Taurus falls on your chart. That's where the focus is for you personally. And then the opposite Six houses, six signs away is where the shadow aspect of this particular full moon is going to affect us personally. So there's the light and then there's a shadow. Both are in play 
and depending on if we've worked on that particular issues having to do with our shadow before, one could be more relevant for us at this time. Now, this is the energy of the Astrological Association is the planet Saturn in Taurus. So Saturn is the task master of the Zodiac. You better work from Rapal. That's uh, one of the theme songs. So you put the time, the energy, the work, the effort in, and then you get the results thanks to the planet Saturn. You don't do any of that, you don't get any results. You have to work for it with the planet Saturn. And Saturn is a slow burn. It's throughout time. But keeping in mind this entire lunar month, November 15th, November 15th through December 14th, 2024, things are in the works. If we're planting those energetic seeds or watering those energetic seeds, planting the energetic seeds would be taking physical actions. Watering would be maintenance of said actions. So the energy of this is improvements having anything to do with the element of Earth. Okay, So the element of Earth issues, work, job, finances, career, sense of security within, self-worth, self-love, self-esteem, self-confidence. I always say that makes us or breaks us. Our physical health and long-range goals. So all of them are up for grabs. All of them are technically in focus, though... There's a spotlight on our finances. So if you want improvement, having anything to do with any of those issues, that's where you place your time, your energy, your effort, and you will get results. If you don't get immediate results, remember it's a slow burn, but still you will see the results. So we put the time and the energy in now we are assuring a better calendar year of 2025 for ourselves. Okay? Think of it that way. It's a self-investment. Okay. Very well. This is, to me, this is very exciting because, I mean, I, en I enjoy money. I mean, who doesn't enjoy money and what it can do for us? And also there's the, the concept of being open to spending money and being open to saving money and keeping in mind that money is just an exchange of energy. So if you hold on to your money out of fear, you actually block the flow of money coming in. Keep that in mind. And if you, this is just, a, this is a very random Example, but apropos, when I first do, when I first was doing tarot readings, psychic readings, and people wanted to tip me, I would not accept it. And, and once I found out that by not accepting that dip, I'm actually blocking the flow of money. Now I say thank you with gratitude because I do not want to block the flow of money coming in. This is a little tidbit for you. All right. Now, moving on to my favorite part, which is the psychic insight. Nope, psychic theme healing song. It's actually the theme healing song. That's what I call it. All right, for this full moon, and I'll usually get like either keywords, but this time I actually got a, a line of a particular song in my head. Money makes the world go round. So. That was that's definitely the song we're going with. I think it's technically called Money Money. It's uh, from 1972 from the film Cabaret, Joel Gray and Liza Minnelli. If you don't, if you're not familiar with it, I would check it out. It's um, it's a fun romp, but it's all about money. It makes everything go around because that's really what we are dealing with at this time. I think I'm going to pretty much leave it there. It's pretty succinct. Mo money. All right. 
So thank you for tuning in and watching. We hope to see you real soon in another video or in a psychic reading with myself and my guides by telephone, in person, or online through Zoom. So until then, let's keep the money going around in our pockets and bank account. Okay? All right. See you soon. Thanks.